Jack, well done. A really good recovery from 3-1 down there. You must be very pleased to have got over the line and especially how you played in the second half of that match. Yeah, very, very happy. Obviously, it's in my home, my hometown. So at 3-1 down, I was thinking, you know, I've got my friends and that there. So let's try and make it, let's just try and make a game of it. And luckily for me, Rob missed on 40 or 50 when he looked like he had a chance to win the match. And from there, I think I cleared up and then made 100 in the next frame and then 80 in the last frame so turn the match around and yeah I, I felt I would have been gutted to have lost first round but um, Rob looked fantastic tonight and yeah it took a it took everything I had to beat him What was it like playing Rob it, it, coming into this you both sort of described it as a bit of a nightmare draw yeah. having such a close friendship and having known each other for so long what, yeah. what was it like it, it seemed like you both uh, dealt with it very well and put on a great match Yeah I think we that was probably as good as we could have been and um, it's just horrible at the end because I win I should feel you know great and and I do but then I got to see him and I got to, and I feel you know it's hard playing your friends it's very tough and then you know you, I'm just like apologizing at the end and I'm sure he would have been the same if he'd have beaten me so um, I guess we've sort of gotten used to it over the years but you can never get used to it it's always horrible but it's snooker so it's a individual sport and you know, if I want to win the title this week, I've got to beat my mates. <laughs> so, um, one down and, you know, Rob was class at the end. He, he was really nice. I'm sure we'll have a practice game next week and um, no hard feelings. Yeah, you both did really nice interviews speaking about each other in the, in the lead up to this. But yeah. uh, uh, how much of an influence has he been, you know, on your development as a player ever since, you know, you were playing with him as a kind of young boy in the club? It's huge, you know, I, I think... Um, the, the way I play, I sort of copied him a bit over the years and learned things off of him. And he's so great to watch. I, I think I feel like when I'm, well, I love to watch him at tournaments when I'm not playing. He, I really enjoy watching him, and he's had he's had a, a big in, uh, impact on on my career for sure. He's someone I spent so much so much time with him traveling all around the world with these tournaments. Um, we always sort of try and travel together and stuff. So yeah, he's had a. He's, he's given me some really good bits of advice as well over the years that have, I think, um, helped my game mature because it, my game's not very mature and he, he's, he definitely wants to help me. So give me a lot of tips and horrible having to play him, like I said, but um, great guy, great friend, great snooker player. And just looking back for a second on what was a, a, a fantastic week for you at Alexandra Palace last week, it didn't quite end the way you wanted, but how, how do you reflect on, on that, and especially those first two performances? Yeah, I'm, it's definitely a lot more positives than negatives. Um, still haven't quite worked out what happened against Williams, but you know, I think like first instincts is that he played very, very well, but got to figure out um, what went wrong and, and, and go again. And, um, but like I said, it was a, a definitely a positive week for me overall. And as, as you've already mentioned, it is a brilliant week to go again this week here, here in Cheltenham, your home event. And uh, yeah, as you say, you can now go ahead and, and really look forward to hopefully a, a, a deep run, run in front of your friends and family. And yeah, then. I really, really want to have a good run here this week. It would be um, extra, extra special, obviously, if I, could, if I could do well, get to a final or something. Imagine if I win it, it would be fantastic. So that's the goal. Let's try and win this thing. But um, I'm into round two. Was it last 16? Have a day off tomorrow. Well, day off from travelling, practice. I'll still be practising and, and go again Wednesday. Well, well done today and all the best. Cheers, mate.